Super excited. Car's been driving absolutely phenomenal. Um, lots of deer on the side of the road. I'm a little traumatized. But uh, we actually took a slightly longer route to get there to avoid deer. Because the last time I went to Florida, I went like south uh, eastern Ohio, down through South Carolina and that way, and too many deer. And I hit a deer. So this time we went straight down through Cincinnati, Kentucky, Tennessee, Georgia, Florida. Uh, I think we'll, it'll be a safer route. So it added an extra hour to the trip, but it's a little, it's more interesting drive as well. So, so far, so good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch some others. Give me, give me wine one time. Hey. Feed me sweet lies one time. Said she wanna freak with the dog. Champion. She wanna ride with the man. Smoke with the man. She come to bring girl for my man Ride with the man, smoke with the man She come to bring girl for my man So that girl make me up with your bubble bu- 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 Give me that sweet bubble bu- 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 Girl come break me up with your bubble bu- 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 no, 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 no. Give me, give me, give me sweet, sweet bubble bu- 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 Alright, so we're back at it again We are filling up the gas tank on the BMW M4 competition So far so good just got done eating some Captain D's. It's good too. Shout out to uh, Captain D's in Charleston, South Carolina. We got about six hours to go, and it's time to go for the show. <laughs> Here in northern Florida, I think we're, I don't know where we are really, but we are headed towards Jacksonville and uh, car's driving great. Got some 93 octane. The gas is expensive here though. 93 octane, 93 octane is $4.24 per gallon. Kind of crazy. But good news, we found some dilators. So, Anybody from the hood that used to have the corner store, remember these dilators? These mugs are on point, saving the day. Got some dilators. What's up, YouTube? So, it's the next day. We are here in Palm Bay, Florida, getting ready to check out the Motivation Studios property. Hopefully, I'll get you guys' opinion on it. Um, I had to get some Waffle House, you know how that goes on a road trip. But uh, yeah, let's get ready to go. We're gonna stop by Keston, race car friends. We're gonna stop by his house, pick him up, and then uh, go check out the property. He's from this area, or he lives in this area. He's actually from Miami. Um, check out the whip. I think we're good. A little debris in there. So let's go for a ride. We're gonna show you guys potential property and I want you guys to let me know yay or nay what you think but here in beautiful Florida my dream is to have a property with some palm trees on it one day so maybe this is it let's go make it happen all right so we just pulled up to the property this was across the street right there. This is what's down the street. 
Uh, there's like a preschool over there. I like this road. It's kind of quiet. I like that it's not making a... There he is, race car friends. I like that it's not uh, over too much traffic. All right, so the land is on this side. Let me see. Let me look at my map. My map. We're getting ready to be right in front of it. So it's this, it's this lot right here. Right here. So yeah, it goes back 400 feet. So it's 100, it's 100 feet wide. 100 feet wide and 400 feet deep. So probably from that pole to that sign. Yeah, but it goes way back though, which is the part that I like. Man, I would, I would hate to lose these trees though. Yeah, that's exactly what I would want to do. But all right, so maybe we could just ride around the area so I can see kind of like what's the area like. But let's 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 see if we can circle around it. But uh, in case y'all not familiar with Keston with Race Car Friends, why don't you tell them about your channel while we walk back there? Oh man, so Race Car Friends is basically just what Will and I are. We're like we're, we're, we met up because of cars and find common interests, and then we enjoy our cars and enjoy the lifestyle and everything that comes along with it. So that's my channel. Like I review cars, have fun with cars, race cars, and you know just kick it with good people like Will. All right, y'all go check out his channel for show. Let me get this uh, phone number on on film real quick. So I can call them. And then I'm going to call this guy right here, too. Oh. Louis R. Prophet, real estate agent. Let me see what they're talking about. I think this is the one they wanted $170,000 for. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can walk around to the back. But... Man, it's, it's plenty, plenty of space. Not too much traffic on the main road, which is cool. Okay. Okay, residential, surrounded by residential, which is cool. All right, so here's the backside of the land. It's pretty, it's pretty. Let me show y'all how far it is. So this is the backside of the lot, 400 feet deep. It's, that's pretty deep. That's a lot of land. It's not that wide. It's only 100 feet wide. So what I would like to do is get the lot beside it and have 200 feet wide in the front. So we're on the side of the, um, the stretch of commercial property right here. Look at the little dogs. But look, look, all the way out there to the street. The pro that's how deep the property is, 400 feet. It's crazy. All right, okay. All right, so there it is. Uh, 100 feet wide facing the street where I can build the entrance and 400 feet deep all the way to the back. A lot of space. It's not that wide, but it's wide enough. Um, but what I really like is how deep it is because I can build a nice driveway, nice parking lot in the front, and in the back I can keep some of the trees for Motivation Studios. Let me, get, let me know what you guys think. My thought is also maybe trying to get the lot next door and have 200 feet um, width in the front of the, facing the street. What do you think? That'd be dope. That'd be dope. Because to me, the, the just the, the one lot seems wide enough, but if you go wider, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, what do you think about the, the space in general, like being right here? I think it's dope. I think it's a good location. Like, if you, you know, you need something to eat, you got a place to eat nearby, close to the highway. And then there's other little hidden gem that I ain't show you yet. All right, so Tess is going to give us a tour. Right, right, right. Yeah. All right, y'all stay tuned for that. All right, so we're in the car with Keston, right here, mm -hmm. race car friends, in his Honda Civic Type R, the new new. What's the color called? Uh, Boost Blue. Boost Blue. Yeah. So he's giving me sort of a tour of the area, and I like what I'm seeing, man. It's real beautiful out here, man. Like the rural, rural Florida, like on this side with the palm trees, man. It's scenic. So, is this residential? Yeah, so this is residential here. Well, actually, it may be commercial because they turned it into, um, like, apartments. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, yeah, because none of this was here just a couple couple months ago. 
So they build on all type of housing. So, yeah, so this one that's is good. Luxury apartments. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna investigate the airport. I bet you there's, I could get like a connection, one connection and get to Melbourne. That's probably what I'll be doing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there is. I'm gonna have to check out the airport and see what kind of flights come in and out. Mm -hmm. But a nice little, little development back here. Somebody out here making money. <laughs> what, how much do you think these cost? For rental? Yeah. If I remember correctly, I think there's like 1500 a month or something. Ooh, <laughs> that's a grip. They look small. <laughs> 1500 yeah. Goodness. Yeah. All right, so it's a little bit, of, a little bit of the development that's going on in Mel Melbourne and Palm Bay. Nice. All right, so Keston then took us to some de deserted island. <laughs> Man, I've never seen anything like this place. It's a whole neighborhood that they planned out. It's almost like a little city, and all the streets are done, but no freaking nothing else. No houses and nothing, just streets. The streets got street names. It's like a <laughs> abandoned city or something. Oh, look at this. We're going to do, do a quick pull. Oh, wow, dude. Yo, it shows when I hit the brake light. Yo. Oh, that's <laughs> crazy. Look at this. Uh, snap. <laughs> uh, snap. <laughs> Dang. Dang. That's not crazy. Yeah, that's Mark you saw that white line? Yeah, yeah somebody yeah, spray painted that. that. Yeah, yeah. This, this is crazy out here, man. <laughs> wow. What up, YouTube? It's the next day, and we're heading back to Ohio. Remember, I want to get your thoughts on if we should buy that land and build Motivation Studios in Florida. Let me know. I'm, I'm thinking it's a good idea because in the wintertime, we come to Florida, I can, I can bring my cars down here. I can shoot content all winter long and um, have some fun. Invite some of you guys down to Motivation Studios, shoot content. And the land is only gonna cost me about 80 grand, 75 to 85,000. So drop me a comment, let me know what you think. And man, gas down here is expensive. I'll tell you that much. But at least they at least they have 93. South Carolina, I believe. So, cars driving great. One of the things I was worried about with the M4, the last time I was about to make it down here, we ran into a deer, and the car looked like it was it was total, but it wasn't total. We fixed it, so now this is my first time taking the car on a road trip since having those repairs. And I must say, Everything is perfect so far with the car. As you can see in the front of the car, the show. Them. Looks like new. A little dirty. We got to get a detail. Some bees and stuff in there. Got to get a detail, but it looks good. We're gonna get a fill up. Get some All right. So, last stop, people. We are now in West Virginia about probably about an hour out from Ohio and uh, the car's been riding fine. We are praying that the deer are not out today. 
So y'all say a little prayer for us <laughs> as well. But um, yeah, last stop, man. We should be home in a minute. But uh, car's been running good. But just gotta watch out for the deer. That's all. But man, it was a good trip. I, I really want you guys to drop me a comment and let me know what you think about the Florida Motivational Studios shooting content in Florida in the winter months and um, having an office down there versus, um, I don't know, I could build something else on the land or I could do a scrap that. Maybe you guys have a better idea of what we, of what we should do. So drop me a comment. Let me know. It's the one and only Floyd Money Mayweather. I'm here to tell you guys to go to Wheel Motivation. The exotic cars is crazy. I've been watching this show for a little while now and it's growing. But we need everybody else to subscribe to Wheel Motivation and support Wheel. I'm supporting them. You do the same.